Hey guys, so today I'm gonna teach you how to create a bind that with one click you will just drop the bomb and it will immediately go back to the weapon that you had before. So whatever weapon you have right now, as you drop the bomb, it will immediately switch back to that particular weapon, whether it's the pistol, for example, or the knife. In this case, you don't want to lose any speed, so drop the bomb and you continue running with your knife. Let's get to it. So the first thing that you want to be doing is you want to go to this folder, Car Strike, Global Offensive, Game, CSGO, CFG. And in here, you're going to copy this file that says server.cfg or just server. And you want to rename it CS2. And so when you open up at the following lines, this is going to be in the description of this video. Alias, drop bomb, slot 3, slot 5. This is important because sometimes you don't have the bomb. Instead of dropping the current weapon that I have, so let's say I have the pistol. When I press the drop the bomb bind, it doesn't drop anything. And then the second one, what it does is it drops and immediately switches back to the last item in your inventory. This is extremely useful. If you're running with your knife out, you just drop the bomb and immediately switches back to your knife. If you have your pistol out, drop the bomb and it immediately switches back to your pistol. And in my case, I have it with keypad divide. In this Steam page, you can see how each letter is called. So you can enter that if you want to use tab, caps lock, whichever key. Refer to this page and select the key that you want to bind. You want to go into Counter Strike, right click, properties, and you will add plus exec CS2. This way, this CFG will be auto executed anytime you launch into Counter Strike 2. I hope this is useful to you guys, and I'll see you in the next video.